All right, FDL. We have FDL here and we're going to play it. And here's my timer. Timer start, just to demonstrate. And continue. Oh dear, we're on fire. That's not a good thing. <laughs> One moment while I fix that. Oh, and you can normally open... Oh, the door control's fried! No, get people in there to fix it quick. I was wondering why I couldn't close the doors, but the door control's fried. Phew, fire's out. Okay. Right, okay. You back to your post, and you back to your post. Now everything is fixed, everything is in working order. Weapons are online. Oh, we're, the rebels are here, we've got to jump. Now, uh, pirate controlled sector, because the nebulae are evil, I find. I, I don't like the nebulae. <clears throat> Excellent. Now, oh, definitely this one. It provides most opportunities for jump. Oh. This beacon is being placed too close to a supergiant Class M star. The ship will gradually overheat until you get out of here. Or die. Well, yeah. Oh, dear. Now this is the type of thing I, I would love to just deprive them of oxygen until they die, but I can't because the fire. Okay, well, oh crap, they actually slightly worry me with a ion weapon there. Oh, if they get a beam across. Oh, oh that was so close. Ah, my weapons are on fire! My weapons are literally on fire! Yeah, I'm not leaving you alone, you attack me, you fools! 16 scrap, I'm gonna get more than that for killing them. Alright, get my Artemis back online. No missiles! Oh, oh, but that, 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 that's fine. Jeez, I can just move that along and keep my burst laser there. I want to get another laser weapon to replace that Artemis because I'm not a fan of missiles. I love them, but... Yeah. My O2 is on fire. That's not a very good thing. Just get him out of there and vent the O2 room. The O2 chamber. And jump away immediately. I can't go to distress yet. Hurry up. Get rid of that fire. Oh, Funkles. Right, get in there, close that door. Just get that oxygen back online. Get it back. Get into the weapons room before you die. And jump away, because oh, I'm going to have to go to the stress beacon now. You locate the source of a distress call. The source of the distress call. A nearby human mining colony. An unknown disease has vir spread virtually among... The I can't speak to this morning. Has spread vir virulently among the workers. They are trying to get a... Get, I really can't speak. I'm, <laughs> they are trying to set up a quarantine to mitigate the spread of the disease, but lack any enforcement and riot seems likely. Oh, I can send my NG crew to calm down the infected. Let's do that. With no fear of catching the disease, your NG crew member helps helps reassure and organize the infected humans. Calmed by its extensive knowledge about human physiology, the infect, infected submit to quarantine in hopes that a cure can be found soon. The colony leaders offer a reward for helping to prevent for helping to prevent an ugly situation. And hello. Now, now we obviously can't speak to that person now because I'm I'm recording um right now let's go wow okay I need I need everyone healed Eww, that's that's an ugly situation you can get back in the engine room that's safe now although you need healing too oh, and everyone's gonna need healing even Janeway needs healing <laughs> Oh, Janeway's not a very good pilot yet. 
Well, she's not really a pilot, is she? There should be a captain post. I don't know. All right, Stephen Fry, back on the engines. You're going to take a bit of damage going through there, but that's acceptable. Now, you, you are on shields, I believe. Yes, Justin is our shield guy, and you are our weapons guy. Oh, wow, the weapons guy always levels up first. I like that. Okay, so uh, we should head into the nebulae just to explore a bit more. I'm going to slow down the rebel fleet so we can get just that bit more scrap that we're going to owe dear. Your ship emerges quite far away from the beacon. You see a rebel ship waiting nearby, undoubtedly stationed to look for you. Oh, I'm going to attack him, obviously. Okay, he's got a basic low-level missile and a low-level laser. He's got drones, and he's not sending any out, and there's no defense drone there, so it's an onboard drone, probably a repair drone. So, what we shall do is take down his weapons, because he's got nothing else to attack us with. Not having any def offensive drones. Oh dear. Oh, oh wow, he didn't hit the system room. I'm very glad about that. Come on, he's going to keep hammering his weapons until he dies. Because he has to die soon. Oh dear. Now, my original tactic when I first played this game and started developing tactics, in air quotes, was... Oh crap. Oh, phew. Was to take down the shields first and keep them down with something and then attack the weapons. But really, attacking the weapons first makes more sense. <gasps> you get a frantic message. Take everything we have. Just don't kill us. Accept their offer. Five fuel, seven missiles, 34 scrap, and an... Oh, yes. Oh, I'm accepting that gladly. An unvisited location. An ion storm? Oh no, not a chance. They might make me play Deus Ex Invisible War. That was horrible. <laughs> I do actually want to finish playing... Wow! I do actually want to play and finish Deus Ex Invisible War though, I've just never had the chance to. Like I just went straight from Deus Ex to other games because well, for one thing, it, it performed horribly on the computer I had at the time, so I couldn't really properly play it. Now, I'm not going to get drones, I'm just going to sell that beam drone, even though it is a pretty good thing. Right, I've got 11 missiles, and that's all from loot. That's nice. I've got plenty of fuel, so I don't need to buy that. They only sell drones. Crew teleporter? Nope. Drone control? Nope. Um, so there's nothing else, nothing I really want to buy here. Which is good, means I can upgrade somewhat. Now, what can I upgrade? You know what, I'm going to save my scrap, because I would love to get three levels of shields. I would, oh, you know what, I'm getting three shields. I'm probably going to need it. I'm not going to have enough power bars to do it yet. Just one more. In fact, I can actually do it now. Ha ha ha! Three levels of shields. Go, go. I should have went to that store first. Crap. Oh, that was foolish. That was incredibly foolish of me. Now that I've got the long range scanners, I can see where all the encounters are. Well, roughly, anyway. Um, none of these I particularly want, so it's a good. So, I'm not sad that I didn't come here first. That's excellent. Um, I could get a few more missiles. Fuck you, I'm going to get up to 15 missiles. I can't get up to 15 missiles. Okay, that's fine. Although, I can't power my Artemis now. Crud. Well, that's okay. When I get some scrap, I can upgrade my, my reactor and then I can, can power my Artemis. Alright, you've arrived at the Long Range Beacon. When the FTL drive is charged, you can jump to the next sector. Ooh. Board the station and look for survivors. Humans, human corpses are scattered across the station. You find the source of the signal. A lone survivor locked themselves in the storage closet. You quickly retrieve them and tow, and tow back to the ship and hope they can recover enough to be of some use. <gasps> oh, we got a new crew member! Now we have no use for him because there's nowhere to put him. 
So let's just put him in the med bay. He can be the doctor. Not that doctor, unfortunately. Ooh, NG Homeworlds. Yes. Now I might just get the event here. Oh, I'm really hoping I get the event. There's a store that's worthless to us. Although, is it? Have we got anything to sell? No, we have nothing to sell. I want to keep the long range scanners because they are really handy. Like, really semi ridiculously cheat mode handy. <gasps> yes! I think that. Yes! Yes, 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 yes! You arrive near a small fleet of civilian NG ships. A simple decryption and translation of their comm frequency tells you that they are having a frantic discussion about something obviously troubling them. Now, we can message them and ask if we can help, ignore it and move on, or have our NG crew member contact them, which is what we'll do. Your crew member syncs with the comm unit to, to communicate with them directly. You offer your help and a summary of the ship's mission. They respond. Our goals have an... An Algus mission elements, however, not all available for disclosure. Discretion necessary. Secret technology stolen by Mandus. Implication, impli implicit connection to rebels. Implicit. Track Mandus to hidden rebel base. Uploading coordinates. Ooh. However, tracked second ship to different base. Would calculate probability, but data insufficient. Cannot risk obvious rebel NG conflict. Also need time to acquire military ships. Assist in finding technology? Yes, we will assist. Now, I want to get Janeway healed up here. Oh, no, we've got no pilot. We can't go anywhere. No. Well, that's fine. We'll just turn off the O2 to turn on the med bay. I'm sure that's safe. <laughs> it is safe, but it's just hilarious to think that you turn off the o oxygen just to turn on something else temporarily. Uh, Now, let's jump to... Now, it'll be at one of these things. I'm going to take the upper route, only because it wastes less fuel. Even through each individual... Even though each individual NG is made up of trillions of nanomachines, their culture still revolves around traditional social interactions. A nearby station seems to be constructed for entertainment of passing energy travellers. Oh, that's nice. I really hope we get this thing. You arrive just in time to see an unusually well-armed energy ship destroying a small pirate craft. A tel what? Oh, a young man that's in a charred uniform is teleported onto the deck. He begs for sanctuary from the engine and offers to serve in exchange for your protection. The engine have already traced the teleport signal and are offering a deal in exchange for the prisoner. Oh. Now, I know if you side with the Mantis, it can turn against you. It can be like, like a trap and you'll damage the ship and then you'll have to fight the engine anyway. I'm going to offer him up. The pursuing ship responds with a completely intelligible message. The young man just jerks to attention and assumes a battle stance. It was a trap, of course. Alright. Oh, I can't spare him. I can't move Jane away from the... I'm going to deoxygenate everything and force him into the med bay. No, I sadly can't power up my Artemis, which I'm actually not going to be able to use because they've got a defense drone. So let's just hammer the weapons. Don't you dare kill my sensors. Now <laughs> you're fighting us in the med bay, you fool. The med bay is not turned on. Oh, crap. Uh, temporarily reduce the our engines just to turn the med bay on. Oh, you silly, silly mantis. You'll be wishing you never attacked us, you know. Because you're dead. I'm going to wait for all that to reoxygenate. Oxygenize, or whatever the term would be. Alright, everyone's fully healed. Turn the engines back on to full and blast those weapons again. Ew, not getting many hits there. 
Come on, give me the hits. I would take down the drones, but that's not going to give serve me any purpose whatsoever. If it was defense 2, I would be in serious trouble. I would need a bomb to disable it. Now let's go, 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 destroy the weapons and destroy them very shortly. You know what, just to be mean, I'm going to destroy the row 2. You know, just because I'm like that. <laughs> I destroyed their ship as well, mind. Alright, now. You are our shield guy. Justin, you... Uh, Reinhardt, you are nothing. Literally, you're worthless to me. <laughs> oh, that's me. Alright, let's get this quest beacon, because I really hope it's in there. You arrive at a Zoltan research facility. The sea they are researching genetic distortion due to stasis sleep and prolonged FTL travel. They ask if your crew has the time to undergo a few tests. Scans. Let's do it. Your crew calmly lines up, lines up for the Zoltans to take their readings. After a short time, the process is done. They contact you. Thank you for your participation in the study. Please accept these small cakes made of stiff dough as well as some scrap. Thank you. Although I have plenty of scrap and can upgrade my power bars now to power my Artemis. Which is excellent. Now, quest beacon. I really hope it's here. You arrive at one of the rebel bases that the NGs told you about. It appears abandoned except for one scout ship. Perhaps you could extract information from them. As soon as they see you, they power up their engines to jump away. Stop them. Yes, yeah, seriously, we have to stop them. You cannot let them get away. Oh no, those things are worthless against us. They can't harm us for crud. Demand information on the stolen technology. Of course, that's why you're here. Yes, they passed by, but I had nothing to do with it. I don't know what they were carrying. I'll transmit coordinates and just let us go. Let them go. You prepare an FDL message containing the coordinates to send to the engines and get ready to jump. Alright, let's go get this thing. That was my fingers cracking, I apologise if you heard that. You have finally caught up with the ships you've been hunting. A hangar-sized cargo, hangar cargo ship is being escorted by a number of Mantis ships. As you reconsider the assault, a squadron of NG ships with pirate em emblems jump in and assist you. You prepare to fight the Mantis, but scans indicate they are manned by rebels. Oh, Alright, you guys are just going right down. Holy crap, they've got a burst laser mark to get those off immediately. Although luckily we've got triple shields, so they'll only be able to, at most, pierce our shields with that. Oh, it's fully charged. Oh, yes, thank you. Now our burst lasers should be enough to keep them at bay. We shouldn't need to use the Artemis anymore. Shouldn't, being the operative word here. Yeah, we can keep them a bit here. Now, I don't want to destroy them. That's going to do two damage. Is destroying them good or bad? I forget. Oh, yeah, this, is, this isn't the thing that's carrying the thing we need. So, yes, we can destroy these. I forgot about that. I really hope we can destroy these safely. The NG emerge victorious from their battles with only minor losses. They message you. Project XMA-56 commissioned by Federation Military, Military Research Division. Advanced Stealth Cruiser. Project finished during Rebellion. Unable to reconnect with Federation Mil Military Command. Military? Military Command. Ask about the Mantis ships. Likely ployed by rebels to avoid breaking non-aggression pact with NG. 97.56% likely. Your mission to assist last Federation fleet, correct? Coordinates? Transmit coordinates of Federation Command. Yes! <laughs> excellent, excellent. Very pleased about that. Satisfactory. Delivery of tech will assist in Federation calls. Gratitude alone insufficient. Commencing ship repair and compensation. Ooh. The weapon... The crews deliver... A, the crews deliver a weapon for installation, but you're more pleased to hear that the Federation will have an improved arsenal. 45 scrap and ion blast mark 2! The NG secret tech has been delivered to the hangar. The stealth ship has been unlocked. 
Oh, I own Blast Mark Three. Holy. Okay, Artemis, you can just go away. That Iron Blast Mark III is fan oh, not fantastic. I need that. Right, now, I'm out of time, but I'm going to upgrade this first. Now, oh, two power bars and two weapon upgrades. I'm not going to have enough for that. Almost. I just need one more weapons upgrade thing. But I will leave it there for now because we're doing fairly well here. Surprisingly well, in fact. Right. Now, I shall speak to you next time and bye for now.